Paul. Paul, useful exercise tonight? Yeah, um, always play a game, it's better than training. Um, but no, brilliant, to be fair. <clears throat> we said to the boys that Forest Green going to come out and play football. And uh, you can imagine, like say, that's not even their first team and the way they play football. I'm not saying the first team, but some of their French players. And uh, it's, it's just a pleasure to watch. And um, I said to Charlie, that's what we're trying to emulate and uh, trying to get the ball from the keeper and play. I thought the boys worked tremendously hard. Like I say, we've got the goal, we've got a couple of goals. But the difference is, like, when you've got a young team, they just run out of legs and uh, they don't just press as a unit. And um, you can see the last 10, 15 minutes where Forest Green kept the ball. And, uh, but that's just the, uh, that's like I say, that's experience. As Forest Green, obviously they, they train every day doing that. Me and Charlie, we only get them for two or three hours a week. And, uh, but we try to play the right way. And uh, as long as we keep doing that, hopefully we, uh, we, like we climb the ladder. Yeah, you only have to look at the team sheet, the likes of Matt Tubbs, Fab Fabian Robert, yeah. Wade Elliott. Kelly. Yeah, you know what I mean? goes on. Goes on and on. And uh, as soon as I see him and I thought myself, it's going to be a great test for these players. I mean, like I said, I think the oldest player is going to be something like 25, 26. So when you play against that sort of calibre, it can, it can only be uh, influential for you, as in going against them. So they'll, they'll come away, they know that they've been in a, in, a, in a great training session, basically. I said, you don't get three points for a friendly, but what you do get, you get the experience of like when you're playing against a team like that, when to press as a unit, when not to. And uh, and when to and like some when to keep the ball and when when not to play too much, as you can see from the goals. Sometimes they, where we want to try and play, they play a little bit too much. And uh, but that's a learning curve. And uh, it's, it was a great experience for them boys tonight. So plenty of positives you can take from that tonight. Massive, yeah, massively. I'm not, like I said, we're we're, we're still like um, getting used to the players. They're getting used to us still. And uh, it's been a long time since they, they, they've tried to play football like that. And uh, at the end of the day, as long as they keep learning and learning and being brave on the ball with no fear, and uh, it can only be best for them as well. Brought a try list goalkeeper in tonight. How, how did you feel he shaped up? Very good. Yeah, I like him. Uh, I spoke to Coops and Coops said, good boy at half time. So, yeah, he, we got him from Julian Jochen, like his connection, and uh, he's done very well. So, I think me and Charlie are going to be chatting to him afterwards and uh, let's go from there, really. And he's certainly got a bit of pedigree about him as so, well, hasn't he? Yeah, so he's, he's only just finished training with uh, Wolves. And uh, so, yeah, I mean, he's confident in the ball. So, yeah, hopefully we'll have a little chat with him afterwards and go from there.